friends this is another case of no hydrophago after the initial steps capsulorexis is being done at this moment and you can see that the rexis is not large it is as usual about 5 millimeter in diameter and now no hydro just inject some viscoelastic substance and introduce the tip of the phaco handpiece here it is this is Oatly Cataryx 3 phaco machine go bevel down aspirate some cortex from the anterior surface of the lens and now turn the handpiece and make the bevel up push the lens little down and enter into the substance of the nucleus hold the nucleus very firmly and make your first chop be there for a few seconds so that fluid goes from center to periphery and now this is what you can say is 3 o'clock chop turn the tip towards 3 o'clock <coughs> hold the nuclear mass firmly and chop it and you will find a free nuclear fragment remove it make this space now what is happening fluid is moving from this crack from this area towards other areas now you can see this is seven o'clock chop hold the nucleus firmly and chop it another nuclear fragment has become free remove it and now you see that the portion on the right side is free now emulsify and remove this portion of the nucleus now try to rotate the other hemineucleus and you find that it is mobile now so hydrodissection is occurring as you are emulsifying small pieces of nucleus so no hydrophaco doesn't mean hydrodissection has not occurred it is occurring simultaneously almost why should we learn this in your practice in your surgical career you will have some cases where hydrodissection will not be up to your satisfaction you will find that the nucleus is not rotating nicely and you are too much worried about how to proceed in those cases think that you have not hydrodis done hydrodissection at all don't rotate the nucleus make your first crack make your three o'clock or seven o'clock job make a nuclear fragment free and emulsify that nuclear fragment turn the phaco tip to another side chop and make another nuclear fragment free and you will find that the nucleus will be free and it will rotate easily after you have emulsified and removed two three pieces so you should practice some cases of no hydrophaco my aim is not to show you what I can do my aim is to find out the possibility within you you are a tremendous possibility find out discover your true potential be a great surgeon develop your intuition to the highest safe level and give very good service to the mankind <coughs> by this time the cortex has been cleaned and this is a hydrophobic 
acrylic intraocular lens being implanted under irrigation. It is very much possible and this is upper summis supra superfo actually. It's a beautiful lens goes through 2.8 millimeter incision very easily. And now hydrate the side port. In this case I have made only one side port. You can use two side ports, you can use bimanual. That is your choice. And now this is the final lavage of the anterior chamber. The final lavage is done and anterior chamber is formed nicely. <coughs> All the viscoelastic substance is removed and the case is concluded. Thank you very much for watching. Hope this video will build up your confidence when your hydro is not good. Thank you very much.